Welcome to Imagination Station Stay at Home Science and today we're doing sink float experiments. So the materials you'll need for this experiment are a container to hold water, salt, and any other object that you want to test to see whether it will sink or float. Density is what determines whether something sinks or floats and to test that out today we are going to put some soda into our fish tank here and see if they sink or if they float. So the first one I have is our regular soda. So I will place that into our fish tank and it looks like it sunk all the way down to the bottom. Okay, so that's our regular soda. And now we have diet soda. Okay, so I'll place that into our tank here with our water, just regular water. And we can see that our regular soda that one sank all the way to the bottom, but our diet soda actually will float up to the top. So what's happening here? Both of our cans are the same size, which means they are the same volume. Okay, so they're not different size cans. But what the difference is the actual liquid that's inside. So in our regular soda, there is a lot of dissolved sugar. Okay, and they need a lot of the sugar to make a very sweet drink like a soda is. And in the diet soda, they actually use a material called, a sweetener called aspartame. And aspartame, you need a lot less material in order to create that same sweetness, which means our diet soda is much less dense than our regular soda. And so what would happen if we change the density of our water? Let's find out. I've got some salt here. I'm just gonna start pouring it in. And we'll see what happens to the rest of our soda cans. Oh yeah, a lot of salt here, a lot of salt. Oh, and we can see that our regular soda, it was once sat at the bottom, now it is slowly floating up to the top, just like our diet soda. And that's because we've changed the density of the water and given it more mass with about the same volume, and it actually will float up to the top. What do you guys think would happen if we test some other objects in water? Test out other objects you have at home and see if they sink or float and post the results on our Facebook page. And if you want more stay at home science, visit our website, imaginationstationtoledo.org. Nice. Visit us at imaginationstationtoledo.org.